thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe below so we can expand our squat. Report number 63560, Class Bravo. Observed. Near Julian, California, while camping a couple of nights up there in a location just a couple of miles south of town adjacent to Highway 79, we arrived on a Friday night and stayed through Sunday afternoon. We were sharing a tent trailer with friends. Both mornings before dawn, I walked my wife over to the nearby porta potty restroom. Both nights were clear and quiet dark and partial moonlit. But the area has a lot of trees so there are shadows even though you can see well enough to walk over to the restrooms without a flashlight. The first morning we walked over to the bathroom without an incident. It's very quiet there, especially in the evenings. The second morning, probably around 0540 as I waited for my wife, I very clearly heard a tree knock. It came from north of our location. When my wife came out of the restroom, I told her what I heard and asked if she heard it. She did not. We walked back to the tent trailer and got back in bed as the sun was not rising until closer to 0700. We were both awake about 15 minutes later and, and both heard a single whoop sound, this time from a bit to the east. Right after the whoop sound was heard, there were blue jays in the trees around us and went nuts making all kinds of noise for about 20 seconds and then all was quiet again. A bit later, still before dark, I got up and kindled the fire just a bit outside and decided to take my vehicle up the road to drop some trash off near the campground office. Another friend from a second tent trailer also camping with us was up at this time. I told her about the tree knock and the whoop that was heard. I turned from the quick errand to the trash bin. She told me she had also heard a tree knock, but this time it was to our west. A few minutes later, I heard two more whoops, one from the southeast, then a couple minutes after that to the south. These were not the coyotes, yippee. Not sure what else to say about it, but it was interesting. I also noticed the tree knock I heard sounded just like someone hitting a tree trunk with a baseball bat or a solid limb. Very solid, clear sound, like we when you hit a baseball. It had been windy earlier that night but when these things happened it was all quiet and still other witnesses my wife friends other stories not that I'm aware of this is my first time camping here I'd like to go back and see if there's anything else similar related to what I heard there is actually other reports in this area um, I'll try and mark them on the map here actually had an encounter uh, kind of a class Bravo encounter as well uh, near here uh, probably about 20 miles from this location uh, time and conditions is 0540 AM clear skies with partial moonlit environment pines and oaks manzanita as well as some other trees similar to uh, quaking aspens with some other wild grapes etc typical southern cal elevation 4500 plants trees grasses follow-up investigator report investigator Matthew Moneymaker this area is a zone of sighting reports extending back many years the Barango Sandman legend come from this area generally. More recently, there have been an encounter on the San Isabel Reservation, closer to Mount Palavar and Lake Henshaw. The witness is a fire captain for a city in Orange County. He said the whoops were too low-pitched to be a coyote, dog, or owl. They were ape-like. Here's what the area looks like. Also, the statue of the local Bigfoot referred to as the Barango Sandman. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe below so we can expand our Squatch search with your help.